Yo, what's up everyone? My name is Andrew Warren, and in today's video, we're going to be doing another transparency update as always. So this is something that I like to do almost every single market day, which is basically revealing my gains or losses for every single stock market day. And so fortunately for today, we just have Tesla in the portfolio. It is 100% of the portfolio. And so Tesla was green today. So all we have for today are gains. And I have no complaints about that whatsoever. And so just beginning off with today's portfolio review, as you can see, we are currently at $156,682.05. And for the normal market hours, we're currently at plus 4.41%. That's plus $6,552.45. And then for the after hours, we are at plus 0.98%. And that is plus $1,526.47. And so before we get into this further and discuss Tesla stock a little bit more, as always, if you appreciate the transparency updates and just the Tesla videos on the channel, please make sure to smash that like button. It really does help me out. So like I said, today has been another really good day for Tesla stock. We are currently counting both the normal market hours and the after hours. Tesla is currently at plus 5.45%. So if we look at the weekly chart, for the portfolio we're currently up 16.71 percent that's plus 22,414 dollars and 75 cents so we had a little bit of a downturn with the 16th and the 17th range but it did start to bump up today in which we got like this 5.44 percent gain so like i said pretty solid gain for the past week up 16.70 percent when you really think about it that's over the annual average for a lot of index funds which is around 10 percent so really solid week for the past month we're up 16.12 percent that's plus twenty one thousand seven hundred fifty three dollars and 48 cents and then for the past three months we are up 59.61%. That's plus $58,512.90. So for the past three months, I'm really satisfied with this. We had a huge run up with Tesla stock. I repositioned some of my fundings with the stocks in my portfolio. And then also for the past year, we are currently at plus 90.35%. That's plus $74,334.62. And also for those new here, the one year chart is the same as the all time chart, just because I've been investing on Robinhood for under a year. So I started on like December 2nd. So if you check out just the amount of money that I've put into this portfolio, I have around $82,277.24 put into this portfolio. And we've almost doubled that number in under a year so far with it being at plus 90.33 percent so tesla has definitely had a huge run up i made a lot of money on apple stock and microsoft stock as well and so i finally ended up selling microsoft stock and apple stock to put into tesla stock and so far that seems to be paying off with apple stock kind of having a downturn recently if we look at the past month ever since this point right here on september 1st apple stock has had a significant downturn it's down 7.95 percent for the past month and the weekly isn't looking too hot as well so me selling that apple position and putting it into tesla stock has actually worked out pretty well but getting into the hot topic for today we have tesla currently at plus 4.42 percent that's plus 18 dollars and 72 cents onto the share price and then we also got a plus 0.94 percent gain in the after hours currently and that's another four dollars and 15 cents added onto the share price so tesla stock is getting really close to where it was at previously with its most recent peak on august 31st at 498.32 and so honestly i feel like we could possibly hit five hundred dollars by the time of battery day on the day of battery day now keep in mind this isn't even really a prediction it's just kind of like off the cuff thinking me just thinking out loud here i would not be surprised if we hit around five hundred dollars by battery day i think monday i, I will say this is like a, a short-term prediction and of course keep in mind nothing that i say in this video or have said already is to be considered financial advice and take this prediction as a grain of salt i mostly do this just for entertainment value rather than me just actually strictly believing this is going to happen for sure but i think we could see a pretty big green day for tesla on monday just because of the hype coming up for tuesday now i can't guarantee exactly what will happen on tuesday just because you may have some short-term traders selling off on the day of selling on the news or, or something like that like we see with the earnings announcements where people sell early sell on the day of earnings or just sell the day after earnings so this could be a similar event but i honestly think we 
could have a pretty big day on Monday, especially given the fact that Tesla was up significantly today when the general stock market was down. A lot of the tech stocks were in the red. VOO was in the red. NASDAQ was down 1.60%. Apple was down over 3%. Amazon's down near 2%. NVIDIA's down over 2%. Pretty much a lot of the tech stocks, the general stock market, and a lot of stocks are just generally down right now, whereas Tesla is flourishing. So there is a lot of hype and a lot of demand for Tesla shares right now, given the fact that we have battery day coming up so soon. Now, keep in mind, this is on a Friday where there's normally a lot of fear, uncertainty, and doubt about what could happen over the weekend. A lot of people that aren't long-term investors like to sell on Friday because they're afraid of what could happen over the weekend that could cause their position to go down in value. So they sell early just because of that uncertainty over the weekend. However, we actually have people buying Tesla stock on a Friday for once in comparison to the general stock market where more people are selling. So this is a huge deal in itself. And I think with a day like today, we can kind of infer or at least speculate on Monday based on how well Tesla performed on a day like today on Friday, where every other stock is performing poorly. And also on a day that we typically see a lot of sell-offs just because of the uncertainty over the weekend. So this is kind of like shining some positive light on the future of Tesla in terms of Monday and Tuesday of next week. Monday, the day before battery day is going to be huge in my opinion. I think we could actually see some more notable growth out of Tesla just because people are excited about what could be announced on Tuesday. As we know, hype does tend to build up with Tesla stock, whether it's before the quarter announcements or whether it's before the stock split or whether it's before major events. So I think we could see some big movements out of Tesla at least before battery day. Now on the actual day of battery day, it's just a little bit more difficult to predict. But I think for Monday, we could actually see a pretty solid green day for Tesla. And then I'm likely going to be buying some Tesla stock Monday as well if I do get some cash on the sidelines. And so as I said in previous videos, I basically stated that I thought it would be a little bit more difficult for Tesla to have like super far into the green days if the general stock market is performing poorly. So if we look at NASDAQ and VOO and some of the major ETFs, the stock market has generally performed poorly for today, yet surprisingly Tesla continues to dominate in terms of just growing its share value, having a significant green day. It wasn't as if the general stock market performed poorly and Tesla just barely stayed in the green at like less than 1%. We got a 5 plus percent gain today, which is actually really notable given the fact that the rest of the stock market isn't even close to that. The rest of the stock market is pretty much in the red. So this is a big sign right here as well that Tesla basically does its own thing. And although we still see a little bit of a mirroring in the pattern, as you can see right here, this pattern with Tesla is similar to the pattern with VOO and the pattern with NASDAQ and Apple and everything else. It's just the fact that Tesla started out higher at the beginning of the day. So it had a little bit more leeway to engage in this pattern because of the fact that it started out higher. So a lot of these started out with the same pattern, but this one just started out barely above the market, whereas Tesla started out much higher above the baseline of the market at like plus 4.81%. So when it starts out higher like that and it has a pattern that goes downwards, it still enables Tesla to stay above that baseline just because of the fact that it started out higher. So anyways, let's go ahead and address the gains for today for Tesla stock. As you can see, this takes up 100% of my position. I currently own 350.91164 shares, and my cost basis is $100,821.76. And for today's return, we are currently at plus 5.44%. That's plus $8,078.92. And for the total return, I'm at plus 55.40%, and that is plus $55,860.29. So 100% of the portfolio and we actually have some pretty solid gains so far so i'm really satisfied with my tesla position at this point in time all i'm worried about is just adding more to that position trying to get some cash here and there and put it into tesla stock so anyways i hope you all enjoyed this video please make sure to smash that like button if you did and also feel free to check out Robinhood and weeble in the description below if you sign up in my referral link, you'll get some free stocks. And especially with Weeble right now, you can get two free stocks valued up to $1,400. And all you have to do is sign up with my link and deposit.
deposit $100 into your account. Keep in mind, you can take that $100 right back out after you get your free stocks. Just wanted to let you all know about that just because, like I said, it is free stocks, basically. And it also helps support the channel as well and gives me some free stocks that I usually sell to buy more Tesla stocks. So it's greatly appreciated, but hope you all enjoyed this video, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week.